welcome to Talking News. Uh, I have a new missing person. It's a silver alert, and it is her name is Sarah Galloway, and she has Down syndrome. That alert was issued Thursday, March 21st. She's 38 years old. Now she's from Arizona. I'm going to try to pronounce this county. I'm terrible at this. I don't, I've never heard of these. It's Pima, P-I-M-A County Sheriff's Department. They are saying that she was last seen at 7.30 a.m. In her yard, well, her backyard of her home, which is 10600 block of West Massingale Road. They say that she just vanished in thin air. They have no sense. They have nothing to go on. They have no leads whatsoever. And police are saying they just don't understand how someone could just vanish without anything in thin air. And it is really killing them that they have no leads whatsoever to go on. That is what they keep stressing in this article. Okay, so she is four foot eleven. She weighs approximately 170 pounds with brown hair and brown eyes. They say that she was last wearing a gray sweater, dark pants, and rainbow unicorn shoes. The heart of the police uh, involved with this, they just really keep stressing. It is very, very sad, and it makes your heart go to your stomach for the fact they can't find any type of clue. And in one of the workers also, she just says she's just heartbroken. Um, she works at the wagon wheel, uh, the corner of West Picture Rocks Road and Sandario Road. The corner store's parking lot has been turned into a command post for volunteers in the community to help search for her. Donald Wadley says, we will be out here we will be doing this as long as we need to be. He, uh, he has a history in uh, search and rescue as well as law enforcement. He says uh, he doesn't personally know Sarah, but Wadley and others have been organizing the search for the 38-year-old. Wadley also goes on to say, I get a lot more worried, but I'm, I'm still hopeful, says Wadley. It's great to see people turn out and help, you know. It always keeps your hopes up high. You stay optimistic that she's going to come home safe. They've also had um, a Customs and Border Patrol, or PSSD, helicopter um, in the air searching for Sarah Sunday. Deputies and members of the PCSD search and rescue team were also spotted in the area. Now, this article is a little choppy, but, you know, it looks like the community is really pulling together to try to find this girl. They say, now, according to the PSSD, Sarah has Down syndrome and functions at an eight-year-old level. The missing alert said that she may be suffering from some kind of delusions where she, you know, feels like the police might be after her. So... If you see her, call 911 immediately. Now, this is a new story for me as well. And if I get time, it's really hard when you're working on a lot of stories and you're trying to get as much information as you can out there. You can only do so much as one person. So I'll try to get more details on this if I can. But if you can, guys, share this. Maybe this young lady just got lost somewhere or, you know, went somewhere that did something she's never done before and we can find her so alrighty guys I am working on a Savannah Spurlock we don't want that case to go cold I heard from her sister I could hear the pain in her voice when she texted and I want to make sure I make a video for that family and get that out tonight as well the bearers might be late guys alright guys see you soon bye